Welcome to the greatness. Lies of P has released and has been fun so far. What stands out for this game is that blocking is the main focus. Dark Souls is more about dodging, but in Lies of P, if you block with your weapon at the right time, you will take no damage. If you do take damage, you have a few seconds to recover some health by dealing damage yourself. This mechanic works well, and the battles I have encountered so far have been fair. No! Along with updating your stats and weapons, you can also upgrade abilities. Better dodging, more special ability bars, and improved stagger are the first options. The weapon customization is interesting. The weapon has two parts, a hilt and a blade. You can mix different pieces to create a weapon that fits your style. Each part has its own special ability. I used a great sword blade with an ability to increase the speed on the next attack. My hilt gave me perfect blocking for a longer time frame. You can also customize your mechanical arm. There's arms that deal massive damage and others that grapple enemies. Freeze! You better stop before I put a hole in your back! Are you thinking it's a game? Oh, it's on that! Oh, shit! All these tools make the gameplay fun. Weapons do have durability, but don't worry. You carry an infinite repair tool that repairs for free. When you are out of health potions, which are called pulse cells, you can recharge them by dealing damage. It's an interesting trade-off. The story has me engaged. I want to know what caused the puppets to go crazy, and what's the deal on this petrification disease that is affecting humans. Overall, from the few hours I have played, this game feels like an excellent twist to the Souls formula, and I'm enjoying it. Thank you for watching, thank you for subscribing, and until next time, peace. I am swift to greatness, remember in case this blows up, get famous, all it takes is patience and skill, I will get to the top, go 100 every video and beat that I drop.